Hey guys, welcome back to Intruder Security. In today's tutorial, we are going to walk you through the step-by-step -step process of installing the VMware Workstation Player on your Windows system, irrespective of which Windows you are using, Windows 7, 8, 10, or 11, this will definitely work for you. VMware Workstation Player is a great tool for running virtual machines on your computer. And the best part is, it offers a free version called VMware Workstation Player. So, let's dive right in. The first step is to download the VMware Workstation Player installer from the VMware website. Open up your favorite browser. Search for VMware Workstation Player. You can find a download link in the description below. Scroll down and in Windows section, click on Download Now. Your download will begin in few minutes. The file is of about 600 megabytes and will take some time. Once you have downloaded the file, it's time to install it in your machine. Navigate to the location where it's saved and double click on the file to begin the installation process. The VMware Workstation Player Installation Wizard will prepare for installation. You may face a pop up saying to install Visual Studio, you will have to restart your machine. Just click Yes, and once your machine gets restarted, start the setup again. Here we are in the installation wizard of VMware. Click Next to continue. Read and accept the end user license agreement. Then click Next. Choose the installation location for VMware Workstation Player or simply leave it as the default. Then click Next. I will change it from C Drive. Here are the user experience settings. You can add them if you want. One of them is related to updates and another is for experience improvement program. I won't be accepting any of them. Here decide whether you want to create shortcuts for VMware Workstation Player and click Next. So we are almost there. Review the installation settings if you want or click Install to begin the installation process. The installation process may take a few minutes to complete, depending on your system's performance. Have a cup of coffee till it completes. Once the installation is finished, you'll see a confirmation message. Click Finish to exit the installer. And that's it. The VMware Workstation Player is now installed on your Windows system. You can launch it from the desktop shortcut or from the start menu. Now you can add your favorite virtual machines into it. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions or run into any issues during the installation process, feel free to leave a comment below and I'll do my best to help you out. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech tutorials. Until next time, Happy virtualizing.